Hello, and welcome back to The Witcher, to the second one to be precise. Uh, we are continuing our first like, chapter or a prologue, however you want to call it. Uh, we have Aryan Lavalet, who we need to help to get out of here somehow. Cells in here. You bastard! You fucking prick! Fuck you, cocksucker! Fuck you up the ass! Motherfucker! I'm gonna fucking kill you, hear me? I'll put your brick off and beat your head in with it! No, I'm a little bit confused. There was another door with what I believe was some kind of a trap door to go somewhere further. Where does that one lead me? Let me quickly adjust volume a bit, because I'm not sure I can hear it properly. Yeah, the sounds definitely became more legible right now. Still no idea where this one should take me. Yeah, but can I switch to some other level? Oh, at least we have some other uh, armor right now. So... Yeah, definitely better. No, there are plenty of... stuff in here. What's that? Crafting diagram. Components required. Oil, venom and timber. Okay. Alright. Uh. 
Arian Lavalette's confession. I, Arian Lavalette, do solemnly swear that I did, sire, and am father to the children Anais and Bushi. Here to consider my siblings, Arian Lavalette. So, but if Lavalette is the father, and Faltus is not the father, eh? Logic. Whose ruler titles himself Emperor? Not a miracle. Don't even have a king anymore. Nothing interesting. Such a big room. What a waste. Nothing in here as well. There are a lot of worn contents. This way. 
Yeah, I know, I just was there. Second door on the left. That's the oil store. Who opened it? Come with me. There's nothing you can do here. I've more to do now than ever before. Alone. I need no one's aid for what I aim to accomplish. Is that your final word? Farewell, Witcher. Alright. Time to make yourself scar. Finally a proper sword. Halt! Blimey, is that you, Witcher? They say you killed the king. Well, I didn't. And I'm going to prove it. I'm inclined to believe you. Glad to hear that. It'd be pretty stupid if I had to kill you now. Did all the Reavers survive the assault? Aye. They've been drinking themselves silly for two days now. I believe I owe you something. You don't owe me a thing. We wound up in a boiling cauldron during the assault. You know how it is when lights get caught in a tight passage. Nowhere to go. Those in the back push forward. Those in the front are stuck. And the halberd blows raining down from above. I'd have been crushed if not for my armor. And about ten blows landed on my helmet. My ears still ring and I puke time and again. But I live and breathe. Concussion. It'll pass. Were you on patrol with the Reavers when they ran into those squares, Hell? Aye. Kenneth mentioned the unit was especially vicious. Notice anything out of the ordinary? A unit emblem or something? Write you up. They had masks made of the cloth of Special Forces uniforms. And they hollered a lot. Your vote for some such. Hmm. Where did the dragon come from? I've no idea, but it saved our asses. The elves ceased shooting at the sight of it. I can't tell you anymore, as we fled right then as if the devil himself was on our tail. Take this. Kenneth told me to study up, but I've not the mind for it. Just not cut out to be a dragon hunter, I guess. It could be useful to you, though. I need to go. There are sentries on the dike. No way you'll slip through. Can you distract them? Um, I'll try. But remember, count me out if there's a fight. In fact, we could end up with foes. I hope not. Go. Just give me a minute. I have acquired knowledge about the monster species. So dragons were once commonplace, the rule over the continent absolute. Dragon fire was the bane of cities and dragon appetites were a constant threat to the first colonizers. Mages stood against these creatures, witchers were created to fight them. Today dragons are nearly extinct. There are occasional sightings of fork tails and slizzards, but these creatures are to dragons as stray cats are to tigers. Dragons were brought to the brink of extinction by professional hunters like the famed Greenfield Reavers. Alchemy ingredients from the dragon's body are among the most expensive and highly sought after by mages. The beast's roasted tail is considered a true delicacy.
Bloody hell, you didn't have to torch the castle. You were to sneak out, avoid anything resembling a bloodbath. You left me the key to my manacles, not an invisibility cloak. Triss, is everything all right? Not exactly. I'm no longer the royal advisor. I've lost my post, my home in Vizima. Witcher's mistress, they call me. Kingslayer's whore. People say what they think they have to. I know, but... They'll change their minds as soon as we find the Kingslayer. Roach will see to that. Right, spy? I'm no spy, but you're mostly correct. An interregnum is chaos by definition. Rats like Baron Kimbolt and Count Maravel rule Temeria now, or strive to. But no one save old Natalis can restore true war. Natalis is far away and of low birth. The crown's simply out of his reach. Baron Kimbolt, on the other hand. Politics is secondary right now. Vernon, learn anything new about the Kingslayer? A week ago, I got a message from an informer in Flotsam. He saw Yorveth in the company of a large, bald man, not unlike the one you described. A week ago? Sounds like a cold trail to me. We need to start somewhere. The trading post is a few days upriver, in the forests that lie on the Adernian border. Yorveth's territory. Flotsam it is, then. Triss. Yes? I'm a bit beat up. Will you look at my wounds? Mm-hmm. Let's go below deck. And I need you to tell me about Yennefer in detail. I want to hear it all, even the things you don't want to tell me, even the things that might hurt. Prepare to cast off! Clear the lines and all aboard! Lines clear, Captain! Honor's a curious thing. Honor made Arian fight a mismatched battle against the might of Temeria. Facing defeat, Honor told Arian to bow his neck to save his men. But that same honor prevented him from saving himself. Life can't be easy for anyone who's unlucky enough to be labeled a regicide. That goes triple for someone like Geralt. Could his luck get any worse? I've known the Witcher for a long time, and I'm sure that kings, courts, and politics concern him about as much as last year's snow. But hey, life doesn't always dole out what we expect, right? Sometimes it even forces us to associate with unsavory characters like Vernon Roach. No, I'm not making any excuses. And yes, I had my reasons. The Witcher spent most of the way to Flotsam talking to someone. Long into the evening, as water lapped against the boat's side, Triss told him forgotten stories of his unexpected child and his toxic relationship with a sorceress named Yennefer. Stories of a life stolen from him. Am I boring you? Don't set this tale aside. Give me just a few minutes more, for someone special's about to appear in dire straits upon a scaffold. Oh, I'm intrigued. Who might that be?
sheathe your sword, Elf. I'm here to talk. Bow low. You stand before a head crowned. That of Demavend, King of Edur, by the grace of the gods, sovereign of the Pontar Valley, and so on. And you are? A friend to non-humans. I have an offer. Speak quickly and to the point. The Arrakis will soon return, and I'd rather know all before then. I can add several more heads to this one. Each crown. Go on. Fault S to start with. I barely escaped in Edirn. I'll need help. Access to your hideouts and maps of your secret trails. And the support of the Scoyatel. I want no gold and have no interest in a killer's fame. Then why do you wish them dead? It's a long story. Your beast nabbed his necker. Time to go. Do we have a deal, Elf? Well, apparently he agreed. Chapter 1. Flotsam should be just beyond the point. We'll take the beach. Who's we? You and me. Reconnaissance. I'm coming too. You should stay behind. We can't be sure of the reception we'll get. Precisely why I won't let you go alone. Someone's got to look after you. That time of the month. Okay. First. Yes. I have my Raven's armor back. Uh swords. I have Diablo, but I want to have a Mahakam Rune Seahill. Uh, I don't have anything for Silver Sword. Let's see. I have worn hardened leather boots. Yeah, that's another one the same. Um, yeah, yeah, let's take these ones. Now, herbalist gloves, I don't intend to change them. Mage trousers. Damage bonus on signs. Maybe I will leave it as it is. I have a bunch of oils, whetstones, and stuff. But I also have a leather enchantment. And all my enchantments constantly go somewhere. Let's leave it like this. What now? Come on already. Trouble. What? Ha! Your witch's ass is gonna have to get wet. Jump! Oh. Something's brewing. Come on already. Kill the weather. 17. What is it? 17 kills? Oh, thank you. Water's cold as hell. Come on, witcher. Ooh. Greetings. What now? Come on already! Damn. 
Any news from your secret informer? The port's blocked. Some merchants have been held up for months. What about roads through the forest? Everything all right, Geralt? Which is silver sword? Diagram. Damage 10, 17, and bleeding. Oh, I think my air and diet is more than enough. Can we go? I am going, just let me collect some shrooms. Where are we? In a forest? Very funny. But who does it belong to? Yorveth, maybe? I know more about the Pontar Valley than you think. For instance, I know that Foltest stole this land from Denevan a few years back. I believe you had a hand in that? Hear that? I smell an elf. That's Vernon Roach. Special Forces Commander for the last four years. Servant of the Temerian King. Responsible for the pacification of the Mahakaman foothills. Hunter of elves. Murderer of women and children. Twice decorated for valor on the field of battle. Yorver, a regular son of a whore. I've long awaited our meeting. Lay plans, set traps. And now you appear in my forest of your own volition. You aided the man who slew my king. King or beggar, what's the difference? One dwan less. Where's your unit? Dispersed by a I raiding party. They're the exactly attendant? where they should be. The I assure attendant? you, no humans can surprise the square tell. Oh yeah, there is. We need him alive. No any useful spells. Set his attention. I need to focus. I'll try. Climb down and we'll finish this. I await. Ha! You're a man without honor, Vernon Roach. An insect I'll not duel, but one that I will crush. Seems like you spout the same old elven drivel. What do you mean, Witcher? I've seen your kind before. Proud and shay, sneaking around forests. Helpless, yet masking that with acts of increasing cruelty. I helped kill Roach's king. You call that helpless? Or would you call me a terrorist? No one will grant us our freedom, Witcher. We must win it for ourselves. You're just another old elf in a young elf's skin, using clever words to mask an obvious truth. Obvious, you say? This is not about race or freedom, or even vengeance. You're here because someone powerful told you to be. Someone who's using you. They may wear a crown, carry a magic wand, or even lead a guild. But be sure of this. It's not about your freedom, your rights, or your ears. Nilfgaard plowed you once. Now someone new does. Am I wrong? Those times are gone. No one will ever use the square tal again. Who are you addressing? Me? Yourself? Or the archers in those shrubs. Triss, now! They are confused. That ought to discourage them. Triss, are you alright? You should have charmed the archers. They're coming.
Get off this piece. The spell's still working. Stay close. Oh, no, first time. Suspense, so no more butterflies. Let's get the fuck out of here. Back to the boat? There's even more of them that way. We must fight our way toward Flotsam. Get your hands off my ass. <laughs> Who did you think it was? <laughs> Yo! Yeah! Yeah! Oh, I'm a commander. I'm a woman. Oh, I noticed. Oh, oh, you don't die man. holding a lovely ass. Come on, let's go. Are you all right? Fine. Bitches. What's happening? All I see are your boots. Yeah. Where the hell is that trading box? You're over! I'm starting to think of waiting. Wait. The barrier's waiting. Triss! Give me a bit more magic. Yeah. Just a little. Kill them now! You know each other? Rather well. But he has amnesia. I actually took the Witcher by surprise when I killed Foltas. Fear not, Elf. I know Geralt. I know his weakness. Too many spells at once. You can die from that. See that? Yeah, the Kingslayer and Yorvith. You all in one piece? Who are you? I'm a witcher. Emirvar Embrice, spice merchant. A trader? In spices. Uh-huh. I'm the woman. My good man, we barely escaped death. Be so kind as to tell us where we might get some rest. We'll explain everything later. Very well. Head for the market square. You might be in time for the execution. Some ne'er-do-wells are going to hang. A dwarf and some bard. There's also an inn and a brothel. Oh yeah, the brothel sounds especially interesting. Take care now. Spice merchant. Not likely. Did you say that? Squirrels that are very wolves. Jorvet led them. I saw him with my own eyes. Who are God, these? Great comments. They're the one boss. Shit! Quiet, woman. Shut it yourself. It is hereby announced that a rich reward has been set for killing of for the killing the Chiron. For killing the Chiron. The hated river beast. Oh no, I'm not talking to a freak. Wait a minute. Be off, or I'll call the guards. Oh, horrible times. Well, I see you at the hanging, friend. No offense, but uh, ah, some stinging my customers. A bunch of non humans and a spy. I heard the spy's cowardly. 
You're a worldly man. Think he'll shit himself? <laughs> I suppose I have seen my share. That spy included. So? He'll shit himself without a doubt. Uh, very, very inviting talk of walk of folk. Well, thank you, Wanted dead or alive, the elf Yorveth, exceptionally ruthless commander of a unit of squirrels. Zoltan. Dandelion, my informer. Just great. What's the plan? We improvise. No killing. We'll take care of this, Triss. Geralt! Geralt! Over here! Help! Step back, white one. What are they going to hang for? They don't look dangerous. The charge is collusion with a score or two. Dandelion, an elven spy? The bard's hanging for debauchery. What? The sentence was he's to hang for debauchery. And a sentence is nothing to scoff at! Are you serious? Listen here, people. Is profligacy now a punishable offense in the free kingdom of Tamaria, or are we in Nilfgaard? A piss off, freak! Or you'll have me to deal with. Think of the common folk, you're spoiling their fun. Well, a freak he may be, but he speaks true. Debauchery is one of my favorite pastimes, but I don't want a noose placed around my neck for. The soldier boys paid us a visit or two, though we didn't have much fun. Away with you, Margot! Go back to your brothel! Time to go? Fine. But hear this, people. He sure liked to parade about, but his willy wouldn't come to attention. Ha! Stop the execution. Shut your trap. The thing is to hang, and he will hang. This is a decent town. Whores and witches notwithstanding. Watch your words, guardsman. I don't know witches, but Margot's a decent woman. Shut it, all of you! Or I'll not vouch for what I'll do. Thinks he's tough, showing off his balls. Don't fret, people. I've seen the rot on them. <laughs> I'm warning you for the last time, Margo! You wouldn't hit a lady. You're no lady! Come on <laughs> up! Got he's room for one more deviant. And we're off to the fist fight, right? Look here, out! Assaulted an officer! Oh, he started it first, right? Anyway. Going on here? I said, what the arse fuck is going on? Uh, uh, I'd like to re re report. Ha, 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 out of my sight, Clover. A few plowing bandits, and you can't even hang them. And you, stay calm, hands off your sword. Our scaffold embraces speeches and hangings. Which will it be?
Your people started it. Short fuses, some of them. What do I care? They started, but you finished. I had to defend my friends. Will you release them? Terrible choice of friends, Witcher. I'd rather give you a thief. Yes. I'm joking. I hate thieves. We can put on another show. Bloody and serious this time, mind you. Or we can come to an understanding. Meaning? Give me a minute, Witcher. Listen here. You may have heard rumours of the tragic events that transpired during the siege of Lavalette Castle. Sadly, they are true. King Foltest is dead. It's likely that Scoia'tael had a hand in this heinous murder. So you see, none of you can feel safe. That is why today, wagons with armaments will roll out into Flotsam streets. I hereby declare a state of emergency. Await orders, prepare to fight, and ready yourselves to avenge your fallen king. Now disperse, go to your homes. What about them? They'll not hang for now. Let's say I'm reconsidering their cases. The scaffold's no place for civil conversation. We'll talk at my home. Your friends are free for the time being, but they're not to leave town. Come after dusk. <laughs> I'll be busy till then. There's one more thing. Welcome to Flotsam, Witcher. They were really going to hang us. I, I don't know. I didn't mean to torch that watchtower. Everything's all right, Dandelion. Let's get out of here. Oh, we all. We owe you to get out. Thank you. Time to hit the tavern. Come on down the line, you need a stiff drink. And while we're at it, I'll tell you an edifying tale of local hypocrisy that conceals lechery beneath a veneer of courtesy. Except nothing can hide the stench. Keep it in, I find something Our interesting here. And drag a contract. Faced with the insolence and bestial manners of the creatures known as Andregas, and concerned for the people. Commandant Bernard Oredo has decided to post a bounty for the extermination of these creatures. The brave soul who permanently reads the area of this filth will receive a generous reward from the hands of we nurse and will be listed in the town of Chronicles as a true hero of Flotsam, Weemers, town chancellor. Oh, it was that one. I picked some other one. Alrighty. Proclamation of pardon for Dmitri. Uh, let it be known that the bandit Dmitri has repented and asked forgiveness for his heinous deeds. Commandant Horeda, known for his mercy, has absolved him of his offenses and accepted Dmitri back into society. Hereby, all arrest warrants and bounties on Dmitri's head are lifted. Head a tangle of forest weeds, chin lined with river needs, Flotsam's barber awaits. Okay, some barber shop stuff, why not? Necker contract. It is hereby announced that Commander Bernard Loretta has posted a generous bounty for the extermination of the Neckers in the vicinity of the trading post. These monsters must be eliminated once and for all. The one to accept this job and successfully complete it will be rewarded with a bouching pouch of horns. Priest will be paid to conduct prayers in our hero's name for 28 days.
So, that's in the evening, and I assume that means that this is the main quest. Maybe it's the tracked one. Uh, go to the tavern and chat with my friends. Necker contract, Andrigo contract, Troll contract. Search for the King's Vice Trail. Yeah, alrighty. Okay, all right, that's how it works. Some crafting. Tutorials. Alchemy. Just a glossary. Okay, that's on the journal. Someday, all the whole. Before that, I really, I really want to finish with the training thing. I still cannot, because I need to... Yeah, alright. Uh, let's go with this one, and then we just need to throw the daggers. Welcome. And some other guys. Charmed. Just don't start any brawls. Peace and quiet. Get it? Of course. I've got my eye on you. This is a very cross food, I must say. Wait, seriously? You look strong! Care for the little contest? For me, here's what you're owed. You ought to give Wiry Wilkes a shot. And where can I find him? Oh, You'll not have an easy time with me. Oh, it's not strong man you are here's your coin you should take on big max doesn't seem to be complicated as well so. you're a strong lad but i'm no wimp either wanna take me on uh yes please i'd like to earn some coin By Veo Patis's balls, you're strong. You're winnings. There's someone else. No one's beaten him yet. Who? Bartholomew Bargy. You'll find him in the village. So Say something. Three souls here. Good day. What's downstairs? 
Like if it's a typical inn, there should be some people who play uh, dice. Alright, it might be the wrong room. But that doesn't mean that we cannot walk around, right? it's the style decision to make rooms like this Carol, why did you drop the thing? Storage system. All right. What do you want? Careful, of dice. I'll play you if you be close to me. Do my eyes deceive me, or are you which of Garrett? What can I do for you? My cousin from Vizima claims you're good at dice. I can play. If word gets out that we've a good contender. Better players are likely to show up, and the stakes will be lost. Maybe even I'm a dancer or a sender of the dance. But then, So, will you play? Sure. Great. We only play for fun, but Zindrab fancies himself a master. I won't play any old challenger. Show us what you can do, and who knows, I might sit down with you. Let's start with Bendik. And then class. Oh, I think I'm uh, I'm rather comfortable with my dice. He was more comfortable. <laughs> you think? Let me show you one magical trick. Do my eyes dis- Am I- I can- Yes, sir. Sure. Great. I will- There's a pair of threes as well. It's a draw. pair of tools. Um, he has absolutely the same. Two pairs. And that was. Let me just show you the magical trick once again. Left 
do my eye. I can. Sure. Six. Oh shit. Uh. Yeah, but why do we play just one out of five? Yes. That makes little sense. But I think I'm going just in, in denial, so don't waste Do my eye. Sure. has a pair of tools. Now I have uh, three of them. Okay, finally we win. You win. Thank you. Care for a game? Care to roll some dice? And that's it. Nope. And I win. Your luck was in. But I want a chance to win my coin back. What do you want? Care for a game of dice? Should we roll a few rounds? and a pair of tools. This is twos plus fives. Alright. Save right after beating Cus. What do you care? So we okay. Let's try this one more time. I see a pair of threes versus. Oh, Apparently, not what just in battles, Care for a game of not ice. just in sword so battles and like monster clearing and witcher stuff, but also in uh, dice battles. I, I really don't like the way poker works in this game. It makes little sense. Oh, it's really, by the way, a very nice combination. You won. Careful, Rage. No, 
Try Einar Gorzel from the Craftsman's District. Beat him and who knows? Maybe even Sendler will agree to play you. Thanks. Look at that paper. So, apparently for the next time we have uh, fist fights, some uh, chat with friends, uh, city exploration, local sightseeing, making familiar with the local quest and such. Um, so yeah, welcome to the first chapter we've done with the prologue. We, we see how this story starts. Uh, so far so good. I hope you enjoy the content uh, just as much as I enjoy playing the game. And please, in such a case, leave a like, subscribe to the channel, or otherwise let me know in the comments what I can improve for you. And I hope to see you next time. Have a nice day, guys. Bye.